Hey guys, this is Eric with Simply Vegas. Today we are touring this gorgeous home right here. This one's currently listed for $870,000. This one has five bedrooms, three bathrooms, and it has 3,493 square feet inside. And the lot size on this one is actually 6,098 square feet. So here we are out here in Green Valley Ranch, right next to McDonald Highlands. As we make our way to the entrance, the HOA on this one is going to be $155. We're gonna be inside a gated community. As you can see, entrance, this one has really high ceilings. So I don't know the height of the ceilings for right here, but down here, it looks like about nine feet. It's gonna be my estimate. Here's where you're gonna have like your dining table right here at the entrance. Let's take a good, better view of that. Yeah, I gotta say, I really love this home. This home has a nice open concept right here at the entrance, these nice stairways. Yeah, let's go make our way inside of the kitchen so I can show you guys that. See, there's gonna be the kitchen right here. This one also comes with the pool and we will get to that towards the end of the video. Are you thinking of purchasing a home here in Las Vegas? Down in the description, I have a free relocation guide that tells you everything you need to know about Las Vegas, from the communities to education, to recreation, and even current market trends. Yeah, beautiful kitchen. You have your kitchen island right here. Let's take a closer look. See a little bit of a glimpse of the pool right there as well. And you have a gas stove right here. So gotta say that's a very nice touch they have that here because gas stoves are the best. So yeah, with all the bedrooms that this one has, only one of them is going to be downstairs, which I think is a very good move to be doing in these homes. Here is the living room. As you can see, you have your very own fireplace and it looks like a little bit of storage right here with some outlets down there. So yeah, you can definitely set up how you would like. Let's take a good view of this living room. So yeah, this one has one bedroom downstairs. So if you wanna have grandma downstairs, that way she doesn't have to always go up and down. Here you go. See, there's no closet in here. I just realize that. But yeah, let's take a look right here. It doesn't officially count as a bedroom. It doesn't have a closet. But yeah, let's just keep looking. I'm gonna show you guys the shower and look at the wall. Like it's like the backsplash that they put inside of the shower. It looks very nice. But yeah, so that's gonna be for downstairs. It's gonna be your very first bathroom that we took a look at. Always gotta make sure you have a bathroom downstairs. Here's gonna be your laundry room, and it actually comes with the sink and this nice setup of shelving. And you actually have a doggy door right here, so you can open that up, kind of have this be like the little room for the dog or for the cat, or however you would like to set that up. Yeah, so this one has a three car garage. So let's go inside the garage, take a quick look. Nice and open, has a lot of space. And as you can see over here, the previous owners or one of the previous owners actually put this shelving up here. So it makes up for a lot of room of extra storage. Use that how you would like. And right here, we have a couple things going on over here. And then you get additional shelving that they put. So yeah, this is actually something I've never really seen before. I don't know if it was like the owner that put this that lived here before, but that's definitely very nice touch that they put into it. All right, back inside of the home. So we basically looked around the entire first floor. Just wanna show you guys the storage over here. So yeah, just your basic closet right here. And then you got some stuff down there. 
not too much going on over there. But upstairs, you have your amazing master bedroom. And I gotta say, the master bedroom in this home is absolutely massive. And then, you pretty much have a little bit of a loft space right here. Not too, too much. And then, let's take a view of downstairs from up here. So this is gonna be the view that you're gonna be getting of downstairs from upstairs. You also got some extra storage right here, nice countertops. And right here's gonna be your master bedroom. And this one actually comes with its own personal balcony. So yeah, I just wanna show you guys how big this master bedroom, because this one is pretty decent size. Kind of goes around over here. So yeah, I gotta say this master bedroom is absolutely huge. You got your nice tall ceilings as well. You have your ceiling fan. And you have your beautiful master bathroom and a balcony. So let's head on into the bathroom first. So you comes with your bathtub right here. Your own personal shower right here as well. And here is the master closet. I gotta say, this master closet is pretty big. Honestly, it might even be a little bit bigger than my room that I live in right now. But that's because my bedroom is pretty small. But still, this is a really nice size master closet. You can definitely fit a lot of clothes inside of here. I gotta show you guys this. Got a him and hers bathroom sink. And as well, gonna have like, basically you can set up a chair and you know, if you're a girl, or if you like putting on makeup or whatever, you can definitely do that right there. Set up like a ring light or some sort, something of the sort. You could do that at the comfort of your own bathroom. Let's head on out to the balcony real quick. I think I had this open already. Yep. So yeah, it's just a small little balcony and you do get a couple views. And the views that I like to see from here are gonna be of the homes that are over there. So those are gonna be your homes at McDonald Highlands. A lot of those homes are very beautiful, worth millions and millions of dollars. And you get that view right there. And you get a little bit of a city view over there as well. So yeah, that's gonna be the views that you're gonna be getting from your backyard specifically. And if you look for this home, you're actually, the height of this home, the elevation is gonna be higher than the homes of your neighbors. So not very likely that they'll be able to look into your home, but you can definitely look into theirs. All right, then as we go back, we have a couple more bedrooms to get to before we head on to the backyard. So we have this bedroom right here. And I gotta say, these bedrooms are all pretty decent size. They're not too small. And this one actually has a walk-in closet as well. go and then it just kind of cuts off right here so yeah there's going to be that one there's another bedroom right here also decent size not the smallest bedroom that i've seen and this one is gonna have the door closets right here it looks like a little bit longer let's make our way to this bedroom right here and this is gonna be the biggest one out of the other ones and the closet is a little bit smaller but this one definitely has more space in it compared to the other ones so you get to pick and choose each room has its own pro slash con and this is the one you get for this one and then you have your full bathroom right here with the him and hers bathroom sink and i gotta say i'm actually really feeling this color that they use for the wall it's like a light baby blue and you have this bathroom right here. And they use pretty much similar backsplash to the one downstairs. And you have your toilet right there. Pretty much everything you need in a bathroom. Let's head on out. So yeah, that just about does it for the upstairs. Let's head on downstairs and let's take a look at the backyard. So yeah, this one's currently listed for 870,000. 
you guys have any questions about this home, any home in Las Vegas would like to schedule a private tour with me so you can see this home in person or any home that's currently for sale in person, feel free to hit me up. We can get that scheduled out for you guys. Yeah, let's take a look at this pool though. So it has kind of like its own little jacuzzi. And there you go. Yeah, it was actually a windstorm not too long ago, like a couple days ago. It was really windy. My power went out for pretty much the entire day. So yeah, I kind of made a mess all around Vegas. Yeah, let's take a look over here at this side yard. You have your AC over there. And looks like there's some plants growing, so you can definitely put your own little farm over there. Whatever you want to use that for, just leave it be. And then let's take a look at this. I like this right here. So you got some plants right here. If any of you guys know the name of this plant, please post it in the comment section. I would like to know because I do think those plants are very nice and really add a lot of touch into an already great home. Let's take a look at this backyard, like the back of the home. And there's a trampoline right here. And then you have your pool stuff right here. So yeah, it's like pretty much closed off so no one really messes with it so that's definitely nice did that and then right here you basically have like your own little side yard as you can see they did right here is that they oops have their gate right here and then you have access to the trash can over here and it looks like this is just kind of like where they had their pet at so you know you have your dogs out here and you know they can go inside for a little bit if you want to let them in and they aren't able to escape and at the same time you don't get a lot of sunlight because of how high these rooms are these houses are you don't get too much sunlight so especially in the summer when it's super hot your your pets aren't going to be you know pretty much toasting outside so yeah that pretty much does it for this home i do want to appreciate you guys for watching if you guys have any questions about any home in las vegas feel free to hit me up feel free to check out my website as well and it shows you every single home that's currently active in the las vegas market and actually real quick before we close up i don't think i showed you guys this this is going to be the pantry right here so here's your pantry so yeah that just about does it hope you guys have a great rest of your day